the heart of Los Angeles, amidst the bustling streets and diverse communities, a sanctuary emerged in the 1990s that would shape the lives of many Korean Americans. Founded by Robert Shin, the Shekinah Church started humbly with a small group seeking spiritual refuge. But what began as a place of worship soon evolved into something far grander, an intricate web of businesses spanning flower shops, mortgage firms, real estate ventures, and a cosy cafe. Behind the scenes, the engine of this enterprise ran on the labor of Shekinah church members, toiling through grueling 12-hour shifts for a mere $100 a week. Robert Shin, the visionary behind this multifaceted empire, harbored ambitions that transcended mere business success. A failed foray into Hollywood as a producer left him searching for new avenues. It was in 2021 that he set his sights on a burgeoning frontier, social media. With the launch of 7M Films, Shin aimed to harness the power of successful social media dancers. These artists were not just performers, but residents, living together under one roof crafting content that married modern dance with nostalgic hits, each song meticulously chosen by Shin himself. Promises of commercials, appearances on iconic shows like The Ellen DeGeneres Show, and performances at prestigious events like Los Angeles Clippers games lured in aspiring talents, blurring the lines between artistic opportunity and deeper entanglements. Yet beyond the glittering facade lay a shadowed reality, one that former members now bravely recount. For them, 7M was not merely a creative haven, but a realm where control verged on coercion. Allegations of cult-like practices surfaced, stories of strict financial demands, signed non-disclosure agreements, and harrowing tales of emotional and sexual abuse. Members spoke of mandatory Bible studies and invasive internet surveillance, where infractions, however minor, met with isolation or financial penalties. The documentary Dancing for the Devil, the 7M TikTok cult, unravels these personal narratives, none more poignant than those of Melanie and Priscilla Lee. Drawn initially by the sense of community at Shekinah Church, their journey soon darkened as control tightened. Melanie's escape in 2011, fleeing from unwanted advances by Shin, stands as a stark testament to the hidden turmoil. Meanwhile, Priscilla's story unfolds with disturbing accounts of grooming and abuse, cloaked in the guise of spiritual cleansing, before she too broke free from the church's grip. Amidst these personal tragedies, the spotlight also shines on the Wilking sisters, celebrated TikTok sensations whose ascent into 7M through Shekinah Church connections set them on an unforeseen path. Miranda Wilking's sudden marriage to fellow dancer James Badash Derek, veiled in secrecy and exclusion of her own family, raised troubling questions about the church's sway over personal choices and relationships. Despite vehement denials of any wrongdoing from Shin and 7M Films, legal battles against former members for defamation underscore the gravity of the allegations. The documentary's raw storytelling and first-hand accounts paint a damning portrait, exposing the pervasive web of control within 7M and its intertwining with the Shekinah Church. It serves as a stark reminder of the perilous intersection where spiritual guidance morphs into exploitation, leaving viewers to ponder the blurred boundaries between influence and abuse that haunt such organizations. Stay with me for more unbelievable crime cases based on real life court documents. Never forget criminals are living with us and crime is everywhere.